Hello, what is up guys and welcome to round 14 of the circuit guide in the championship. We are at one of the most exciting tracks on the calendar at Suzuka in Japan. Uh, came off the calendar for a couple of years in 2008 when the Japanese Grand Prix was held at Fuji but was brought back to Suzuka. I guess a lot of people missed it. I certainly did. And it's only tradition, Honda are back on the Formula 1 roster if you like, being a engine supplier for McLaren, and we are in our McLaren Honda about to go around the racetrack, so let's get into a flyer. So setting up the lap now, we've got to get the chicane right, we've got to get our line right to set up the lap. You've got to get your foot down as early as possible because it is quite a bit of a straight, longer than most people realise. So slowly getting up to eight gears, the car is underpowered as we all know. Coming into turn one and two, it's just slowly taking your foot off the throttle and going down through the gears and then getting back up them again. Now we're in the S's, so it's literally one corner after another and you've got this absolutely vital that you have grip and absolute downforce in this kind of area for your car to be able to be glued to the track. Coming out of the S's now, coming into the quick right hand up and that is set to one down down, set to two, a simple 90 degree right hand there in third gear. Coming up to the hairpin now, down to second gear. Really tight, tighter than you would expect it to be. Foot down again, flick it up through the gears, in sixth, in seventh, coming up spoon curve now, I believe. Drop it down a couple of gears to fourth, drop it down to third again for the long straight. You've got to make sure that you get traction, it's really important along the straight here because you're flat now. Working up through the gears. Coming up to 130R, again a really special corner. You're absolutely flat. And before breaking down into chicane again, the final chicane in second gear, you're absolutely hooking the car up absolutely beautifully. Before getting on the throttle, back on the DRS for the short sprinter line, and it is a 140.8. Not too bad for a McLaren Honda. But that is it for round 14, guys. Join me next time when we're at round 15 in Russia. I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye for now.